I'm Phil. This is I'm Annabelle. Liliana and Zoe. And our newest member of our family. Yeah, Ricky. Ricky. Yeah, our brain's really cute. This is Ricky. When we got him, he was like nine, ten weeks old. Yeah. He was hand fed, which made it a lot easier from what I'm reading from people. He's our first bird. A lot of people will get them and they're not real friendly. Mm -hmm. Ricky was friendly right away. Yeah, right away. Like like he he know like how you talk to him, like listen to you and he talk to you back. Things that surprised me was just how friendly he was and how much attention he wanted. Yeah, he wanted attention. Yeah. <laughs> He wants to be really friendly. What would happen if Daddy came in the room or he heard my voice? If he called you, you want him and I get him for you. You would get him for because he would start making the noise right away if I yeah. came in the room or he, he heard have my a voice. Sound right away, like if like his daddy is coming yeah, from the downstairs. You, and you play Minecraft, I'll give him you. Uh, if I was playing a video game, I needed to have him on my shoulder. Definitely, that's a good point because he wanted to be right with me. He didn't want me to do anything really with him. He wanted to sit on my shoulder or if I was laying down on my stomach. Yeah, he wants like looking to to my face, my husband. Yeah. Uh oh, we'll change places. I think baby wants mama, mama and Bert can come over to daddy. Yeah, so you want to be with, oh, he also likes rings, so you got to be aware of that. If you have a ring on, he is going to try to eat the ring. Hey, don't yeah. eat the ring. Don't eat the ring. Yeah. Um, so you need to have plenty of time for your bird if you get a cockatiel that is very friendly to play and, with them. And we have a playground for him. Yeah, we, they want exercise and things to do, so we bought him a little playground. A cage. Um, he sleeps in the cage. We, I think that's another issue that I didn't know is how much you'd want to be outside of the cage. Yeah. And, and I and feel then, a little guilty if we keep him in the cage too yeah. long. Yeah, and then he wants like if like he come out the cage, he want like a practice her wings. His wi oh yeah, he'll, he'll put right. his wings out, spread them, oh, especially yeah, how we holding him. Practice the wings and. Bless you, God bless you. Yeah. Practice the wings. And yeah. I love talking to you. A lot of talking to you. Yeah, right? so far this video is not really doing much talking. Yeah. yeah but, but he'll definitely do a lot of talking. He'll go on the fingers. Having a four-year-old, we've had to teach her fully how to handle a bird and how not to. She thought at first he was like a dog and wanted to pet him and mm -hmm. all different things he wasn't as excited for. So at first he was like jumping out of her hand quickly. Yeah, jumping. <laughs> but she's getting nicer and nicer to it. Mm -hmm. She likes him a lot. It's not the problem that she doesn't like him. It's a problem that she's four year old and yeah, learning how to handle. She's learning like how to handle. Yeah. Yeah. You want to catch birds, okay? okay. <laughs> yeah, but he likes a lot of attention. Um, we got him a millet um, to eat when he was young, mm -hmm. and he spent the first couple weeks eating that besides his regular food. Regular food. Yeah, it's very fatty. As he gets older, he'll eat less and less of that. We got that more because he was a baby, needed a lot of just a lot of calories. But now he's eating his regular food really well. Mm -hmm. Re what? Yeah, and then he'll listen to me if like he's starting walking the floor. And floor or the ground? Yeah, floor. The floor, yeah. yeah. He's starting walking and then if I call him to him, he go with me. Yeah. And then he follow me the kitchen. Like, like you know, like a, like a real person. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he seems real emotional. Like he wants us, he wants our attention. He wants to be with us, yeah. and so we have to make sure we give him attention every day. Yeah. We change his water several times a day. Mm -hmm. I change his food and cleaning her, you know. 
He is gay. Age. Age. <laughs> so, so it's work. It's not just sits in the corner. He, he needs to, his attention. Yeah. So it's if you want a pet that wants attention, but in other ways it's real simple. You know, you yeah, can... Yeah, very simple. And then I love it. Yeah. Yeah. He's really cute. Yeah. I think if my door, home. if door like growing, a little, grow a little bit, yeah. I think he, she know like how to handle the bird. Right now it's like for 50-50. Yeah. <laughs> you know, we just gotta keep, keep teaching her and she'll get better. But he wants attention, so yeah. she, and she loves giving attention. So they'll get to be good friends and we'll keep teaching her. A heart. heart. A heart. Oh. Yeah. Like she mean like love bird, I think so. Oh, like you want a bird for him to marry? Oh, he's gonna get married. Yeah. He wants a girl. A girl. Wants to, yes. Girl. We've been told he's a boy. Um, he's young, so he has, I guess, officially been doing it. We spray him to, to wash him. We have a little spray bottle. Um, some birds I've read don't like that, mm -hmm. others do. He doesn't react much at all when I do it. He seems okay. He stays right on my finger. And I spray him all around and wash him that way. Yeah, he wants, uh, uh, he wants the water. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it cleans him up. I tried the first <laughs> you, Oh, you have done it too. Yeah, okay. I tried it. I was worried like he don't want me, you know. We put it on like mist so it gets them all wet but just not a threat. On their cheeks? Oh, I mean the orange? Oh, uh, the big circle. <laughs> and he has the baby in his tummy. No, he doesn't have a baby in his tummy. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> that was mommy. <laughs> <laughs> mommy, look at the door. It's So would you recommend a cockatiel as a pet? Cockatoo and cockatiels. Yeah. This is a cockatiel, which is part of the cockatoo family. Can you, when I see the camera? So, uh, so he's a cockatiel, which is part of the cockatoo family. So if you have a cockatiel, you have a cockatoo, oh, but he's the smaller type of cockatoo. Yeah, yeah like you see, he, he's like playing with my neck or something, he found something. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> um, they, they don't really bite, it's more of a ticklish type of feel. <laughs> that, yeah, that it's not it's, it kind of tickles your neck a little and bit. He's, and he's hungry. <laughs> he's hungry. I think I'll put him back with his food and let him eat some more. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, oh my god. It's funny. Oh gosh, it tickles. Tickles your neck. Yeah. Okay. Well, thanks for watching, everyone. Thank I hope you, you like our bird. Yeah, thank you for watching, say hi, guys. Ricky. Ricky, say hi. Ricky, say hi. Say please subscribe. Bye.